This episode is called The Royal Rival. It starts off at the school, where Sarah is showing the class her newest invention, and it can pretty much turn any food into a healthy cookie you can have for every meal. It sounds more like Diabetes City, but okay. And in Galvanax's ship, we see Princess Viera of the Lion Galaxy show up with her royal guard, Julian, and she has her sight set on destroying the rangers and showcasing her power. Her outfit looked silly at first, but she makes it look pretty cool, in my opinion. The rangers in the meantime are helping Sarah sell some cookies from her machine, and Victor and Monty end up getting busted for stealing a cow, and all I could think was, awesome! Redbot then contacts the rangers and tells them that there are buzz cams heading their way. They go to check it out, and there was Drillion causing trouble, and Princess Viera watching from above. She ends up getting hit by one of the attacks, Sarah saves her from falling, she orders Drillion to stop fighting, and they head back to Galvanax's ship to explain what happened. She then tries to convince him that she wants to defeat the rangers in her own way, but since Galvanax doesn't trust her, he basically tells Drillion to betray her, and he agrees without thinking twice. So much for being a royal guard. Viera then checks out Sarah's cookie machine in disguise, looking as pretty as ever. She tries one. A random kid takes them away. She catches him with the intention of punishing him for stealing. But Sarah says no, and decides to give him the machine, because he and his sister have nothing to eat. Viera questions why she did it, and Sarah says that sometimes people don't need punishment, but that they need help and a second chance. And this was when Viera made the luckiest guess ever. Somehow she knew all this time that Sarah was a Power Ranger, even though she never saw her morph. It's not explained how she knew, but I think it's safe to say that she does indeed have a connection to the Nexus Prism. Drillion then shows up and calls Viera weak, and makes it clear that he wants to be the new ruler of the Lion Galaxy. He goes on the attack, Viera helps her, the other rangers show up, morphing right away, they try to get the upper hand, and not only does he overpower the rangers, but he is able to break their element stars and their swords. Talk about brutal. Galvanax then orders Cosmo Royale to make him grow, the rangers form the Ninja Fusion Zord, and Drillion defeats them without even trying. And just when it looked like the rangers were done for, Viera came to their rescue with her all-powerful Lionfire Zord. Drillion retreated, Galvanax shoots her down, and now she's on her own. We then cut to the police station, where Victor and Monty are sent to jail for stealing the cow. And this, without a doubt, is what I would call epic. This episode was pretty good. My favorite parts was seeing Viera, who I thought did okay, despite the not-so-great writing, the fight between the Rangers and Drillion, which was very intense, the Lion Fire Zord, which was awesome, and of course, Victor and Monty getting arrested, which made the episode that much better. I'm just hoping that the Rangers don't destroy Drillion in the next one, because they've established him as being a much stronger villain than Ripcon. So I hope the Rangers and Viera fight him for a few more episodes, and I'm also hoping that Victor and Monty stay gone for a long while, so that when they do come back, they'll become more mature as characters, and less annoying. That would make sense, but I think the writers have other ideas. Though I hope I'm wrong. So with that being said, I'm turning it over to you guys. Did you enjoy the episode and have any favorite parts? Do you think the show is getting better or worse? And what is your favorite kind of cookie? Let me know, and until next time, this is John from Mr. Winnie Productions signing out.